Gary V. You all know him as the entrepreneur who's a genius in the online business world. What you probably didn't know about this man is he's a very astute investor. He invested early into the likes of Facebook, Twitter, Uber, Tumblr and Snapchat, making a lot of money. You see, the thing about Gary V is he's a man that thinks outside the box. He says, my financial advisors were upset that I put all of my money into Facebook and Twitter. Sticking to your guns has a lot of value when it comes to investing. I look at only two things with angel investing. Are you solving an important problem? And do you care about the end users? And this strategy has made Gary enormously rich. His net worth is projected to be around $200 million. Now this all came from very smart investing and business in the past. But we don't want to know what Gary V has invested in the past. We want to know what Gary V is investing in the future to continue to build and grow his wealth. So that's what I'm going to do in this video. We're going to go over Gary V's current investment portfolio. Uh, he currently owns 79 stocks through his investing firm, Vayner RSE. Uh, we're not going to go over all of those stocks, but we will go over the top 10 key stocks that Gary V owns with his investing firm. One of the more fascinating companies that Gary V owns today is a company called Coinbase in which Gary invested back in January 2015. Coinbase is a digital currency wallet and platform where merchants and consumers can transact with new digital currencies like Bitcoin, Ethereum and Litecoin. Uh, they have over 30 million users around the platform with more than $150 billion traded. But why is this important? Okay, because the number of people using blockchain is increasing at a rapid rate. Uh, as you can see, from mid-2016 to the end of 2019, blockchain users more than quadrupled. Uh, and in the future, I don't see this slowing down too much because, as you know, blockchain is just so much more efficient as a source of currency than what we have now. So what this means for Coinbase is more money basically. Just think if in the next four years, blockchain users quadrupled again. This means more people buying and selling using a Bitcoin wallet and will mean more revenue for Coinbase as a platform. The potential is very high and Gary V sees this. He says, I am unbelievably bullish on blockchain technology. I don't know if Bitcoin or some of the other coins are going to be the currency that wins, but this will be like somebody saying to me, do you believe in the internet? Well, let's just say Gary V, he likes blockchain a lot and he likes Coinbase. The Drone Racing League. Now, this might sound like a silly idea to some people, but guess what? Facebook sounded like a silly idea to most when Zuckerberg first introduced it. Same with Amazon. Same with Microsoft. It could be the same with the Drone Racing League. So the Drone Racing League is basically what it says in the name. They're a league that instead of racing Formula 1s or rally cars, they race drones. Uh, Courts described DL as feeling like pod racing from Star Wars. Uh, and the company has hopes of becoming the Formula 1, NASCAR and MotoGP of drone racing. Uh, and they're not small either. They're broadcasted on some of the best networks, the likes of NBC, NBC Sports, Twitter, Sky Sports, uh, and other big names. And they have big partners and sponsors behind them. Allianz, BMW, the US Air Force, Lockheed Martin, uh, and all of the other companies that you see here. This company, I'm sure you all know. It's a social media company called Snapchat. Snapchat is basically a messaging app where you can send photos, videos, and text. It's mainly used by the younger generation of this world. Now, I personally don't think Snapchat is the best investment for 2020 and beyond. Why? Well, because it's a dying platform. Uh, as you can see, the likes of Facebook, Instagram, and WhatsApp, they've all grown. Snapchat 
has actually declined in daily active users. So this is why I don't want to talk too much about Snapchat. Let's move on to Gary's other investments with a lot more potential. This next investment by Gary, I think it is such a smart idea. So the company is called Lawn Starter and it's basically like Uber, but for lawn care. So if you want to get your lawn done, whether that be mowing it or trimming trees, irrigation, anything, all you have to do is go in lawn care and book an appointment. Uh, same with a gardener who wants work. They just put their profile on lawn care and they can get hired. Then obviously lawn care takes a cut of this revenue. Uh, it's typical Gary V investing. He's always thinking outside of the box. Uh, you got Uber for cars, but why not do this for lawns as well? Uh, very smart. As Gary V says, innovation isn't a tactic, it's a religion. Uh, you need to spend all of your time and energy on creating something that actually brings value to the people that you're asking for money. And that's exactly what lawn care does. So, Amaze. It's basically an online fundraising platform that offers campaigns and merchandise in support of charitable causes. So basically what you do is you can buy tickets to enter the chance to win any one of these prizes, depending on what you like. Whether that be uh, exclusive access to Pearl Jam shows, or to win a Sprinter van, or to stay in a Cinderella castle suit. Uh, and the best thing about this is your money helps go towards charity as well. So it's a win-win situation. So you know you've got Facebook. That's basically a social media sharing platform. Instagram, it's the same but for pictures. Twitter, that's for quick written thoughts. YouTube, it's for videos. But Medium, this company by Gary V, is a platform for blogs. So basically what you do is you go on the website and you pick the topics that you're interested in. Technology, food, politics, AI, uh, whatever that is. And then you go and you make an account and it's basically like Facebook, but for blogs. It's typical Gary V investing. He's always looking for the new idea, the new platform that will change the way we live. Now, as he says, all the best apps, companies, and products have broken the way we live life, transformed how we communicate, and changed our day to day. Good products evolve us. Now the thing is, VR is an industry that is growing rapidly. It's a technology that is revolutionary. Now imagine me telling you this even 10 years ago, that you can put on Google and you'll be in a virtual world. You wouldn't have believed me. Just like people wouldn't have believed you 40 years ago if you said you can video call people face to face on something called a computer, or that you listen to the radio, or that you watch TV. Yet here we are. And it's the same with VR for the future. VR hasn't fully set in place like TV has or radio has. It's something that has high growth potential, which is why Gary V likes the industry. And this is where his investment in visionary VR comes into play. They're a technology and content development studio relating to VR. They also have visionary focus under their belt, which is a tool for virtual reality content creators to make content using VR. Uh, by 2026, the virtual reality market is expected to be worth $120.5 billion, and Gary, he wants a piece of that pie. Okay, this company is also quite interesting. Well, first I'll explain what it is, and then I'll explain why I like the idea. So, Breather is a company that provides flexible workspaces, mainly in the USA and Canada. They provide meeting rooms, workspaces, offices, uh, whatever you're looking for, on demand. So, why do I like this idea? Well, you see, because more and more people now need flexible workspaces. More people work online than ever before. They don't have a set office, just like myself. So as this number of online workers grows, which it is growing at rapid rates, the more this company will be able to profit. Okay, now we're getting into the workplace. 
Gary V, always thinking outside the box, what companies can I invest in that are making the workplace more efficient? One company that is doing this is called Namely. Uh, Namely was founded to create an HR platform as intuitive as social media, but powerful enough to support the complexity of today's workforce. Uh, And the platform has grown big now. Their HR platform now serves over 1,400 mid-sized companies. Lastly, we need to talk about this investment in Moment. And Moment is basically a modern day company for photography geeks. Uh, they make lenses for your smartphone, they carry and make the gear that creators rely upon, they service customers 24 7, and they have online lessons as well relating to photography. So it's just a typical Gary V investment, really. He's thinking, how do we modernize photography? Well, people need certain lenses for their smartphones. Let's sell these online. Then we can sell all other types of photography gear as well. Just like Amazon, but for photographers. So it's very smart. And as you know, with pretty much all of Gary's investments, he's looking towards the future. What business will do well looking forward and make money and potentially be a big thing. As he says, before you invest in yourself, you have to invest in your long-term future. Uh, I'm just always looking forward. I spend very little time looking backward. Uh, It's a very different strategy to the way Warren Buffett invests. He's more into strong fundamental businesses with a strong history behind them. Uh, And this is why I recommend strengthening up your portfolio with strong fundamental businesses before investing in those high growth riskier, futuristic investments. That's why I like to look at Sven Carlin's portfolio and stock buys so that I can get good ideas for companies that are fundamentally sound. And then you can start investing in businesses similar to Gary V. It's just a balanced approach between riskier businesses and more sound businesses, if you know what I'm saying. Either way, I do like Gary V style as well, and it has made him a very wealthy man. So he's doing something right. And I think that this portfolio of his, along with his other investments, they're going to set him up on the right path financially for the future.